What's up you guys, Eddie here Fliptronics. So I'm gonna be talking about if the iPhone 8 Plus is outdated. All right, so this phone has been out for a couple of years now. We've seen the 10, the 10s Max, the 10s, and the 10R come out since its release. But the question really here is, is this phone still good to buy? You know, I'm gonna tell everybody out there this phone is still absolutely good to buy right now. And with the price point it has on it, it makes for a really good budget pick. So I'll have a link down there if you guys wanna check out our full review or if you wanna look it up on Amazon Renewed, which is where I picked this one up and I recommend getting it there because you get a 90 day money back guarantee on any phones that you buy. All right, so I'm gonna be doing a gaming test with this. We're gonna do a video quality test, a sound quality. If you have any questions about it, you can message me below in the comments, but let's get right into it. All right, so anyways, right now you can get this phone anywhere between 400 and 450. You might actually be able to get it even a little bit lower than that and the price will continue to go down slowly over time. But uh, as far as design, you know, it's got the front and back glass. Um, it's got an aluminum frame on it. It's got a 5.5 inch LCD display that looks awesome. It's got an Apple 11 A11 chip in it. So I mean it runs, you know, pretty much any high graphic game. The phone is still very fast. You know, I've compared it with like uh, the 10R and the 10S Max and it's not as fast as those phones, but it's by no means slow. Um, it's also pretty easy to hold one handed. This is a plus size phone, but you're not going to have an issue holding it. Uh, you know with one hand it's got a nice camera on it it's got the um, you know the 12 megapixel on it but it's also got the optical zoom feature which lets you uh, you know zoom in on you know any kind of like pictures you want to take all right so anyways let's get this uh, let's get this phone up here so you know the thing that I do miss about um, you know like the eight the eight uh, the eight plus and anything below that is the home button now the home button is gone on the newer iPhones obviously but I do miss having it you know what I'm saying so anyways I'm gonna throw up uh, some Netflix here we'll check out some next Netflix quality on uh, you know just watching video with this um, and I'm gonna get the volume turned up on here so you can kind of hear it uh, on full blast basically but anyways let's load up uh, Inglorious Bastards this is a great movie I haven't seen it in a long time it's gonna kind of Skip through a little bit here, get this thing rolling. All right, you can definitely hear the sound quality on this. This solid. Map where they are? You gotta tell me how many they are, and you gotta tell me what kind of artillery they're carrying with them. Man, this is a great you movie. You can't expect me to divulge information that would put your lives in danger. Well, no, Warner, that's where you're wrong, because that's exactly what I expect. I don't even know. All right, let's load up some gameplay. I'm going to load up Rush Rally 3, um, just because this is an awesome racing game. And we'll get into a race here. But, uh, you know, like as far as, you know, speed goes, performance with this phone, still, you know, very solid. And, uh, you know, like I said, I just think that... If you're looking to, you know, maybe get an iPhone, um, you know, on a lower price point right now, I think the A Plus is definitely where it's at. Ooh, we're cruising a little bit off there.
Ooh. All right, we definitely went off a little bit right there. What? All right, I'm coming up to the uh, finish line here. All right, I'm gonna take it back. Uh... Ooh, okay, okay. I'm gonna take it back to the uh, home screen for a sec here. So, anyways, um, you know, do I think this phone is outdated? I do think, you know, um, you know, we've had quite a few uh, different iPhones come out since its release, but I still think that this phone is honestly it, it's solid. I think this is a solid iPhone, uh, especially if you're on a budget. I think this would be a great pick for just about anybody and the price point on it right now is you know it's very affordable i mean you can pick it up like i said anywhere between like 400 um to 450 sometimes a little bit lower than that um it's good for gaming it's good for watching video it's got a nice design on it it's still got the home button um and if you want to get an iphone uh any iphone for that matter i do recommend getting it off of amazon renewed because that's where you can get a 90 day money back guarantee. Um, and that's where I've been buying a lot of uh, you know my phones if they're like kind of used or refurbished. So I'll have a link down there if you guys want to check out our full, re full review on this phone on our website, as well as a link down there to pick it up off of Amazon. If you have any questions about it, message me below. Uh, if you could also hit that like button, I would definitely appreciate that so we get this boosted up in search. If you have not subscribed to our channel, hit that subscribe and we'll see you later.